everyone, welcome to this week's episode of Drossom Gaming. I'm Stephanie Sandwich, WoW player extraordinaire. December's theme has been stolen from November because, hey, Blizzard in December is now outside the realm of reason. For the first episode of our Blizzard Entertainment Month, I'm going to talk about how I got my realm first herbalist achievement. For World of Warcraft expansions, I hardly ever opt into or participate in betas. Mists of Pandaria was the first expansion I dedicated any considerable amount of time to in the beta before the release of the game. Up until then, I loved to experience the content raw, unfiltered, and without bugs. As amusing as glitches might be, it takes you out of the experience immediately, and I just want to enjoy myself with childlike innocence and glee for the first few days. One of my favorite things to do is farm. If you watch any of my, I mean, uh, pa- Pamela's, World of Warcraft streams, you would know if she, me, I, she had a bumper sticker on her, our mount, it would say, I break for flowers. There's something about picking flowers that is just so serene and calming. I don't even use them for active crafting, I just pick flowers. And this expansion, I wanted to be the best at it. And first! So thus began my quest to achieve Realm for Serblist. There was more to getting Realm First Herbless than just picking flowers. There was competition. There were zones you couldn't access by mount. Before everything synced to your level, every zone had a target level. This made it hard to pick flowers while avoiding aggro from the local sentient plants or whatever shaw monsters were in the area. As you level up your herbalism, 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 you're less likely to get skill ups from certain flowers. So, I need a game plan to pull off my master plan. My master game plan. So, torn pick flowers faster, plus have a plus 15 boost to herbalism. Add the herbalist gloves and I have an extra 5 points in herbalism. I am a feral druid so I can prowl around things that kill me with talents and swiftness. So, I ran at a normal kitty speed even while invisible. With the incarnation talent, if I did get aggro, I could immediately go invisible, lose the aggro, and move on to the next flower. I'd pick like five flowers in the first zone to get the herbalism levels needed and dash to the next zone where no one else would be. No competition from that point on. I deleted and recreated my character and timed my route. I practiced for weeks. Cut to midnight, September 25th, 2012. Time for the big game. I logged out by the herbalism trainer, so the moment that I logged on, I trained my Zen master herbalism. I flew immediately to the portal to the Jade Forest. While everyone around me crowded around quest givers, I was doing real work. I stuck to my plan, sneaky kitty dashing around, picking flowers, running away from aggro, picking flowers, dashing to the next zone, picking flowers. Then finally, on the peaks of Kunlai Summit, I picked the last snow lily that brought me the 600 herbalism. My heart raced and I jumped out of my seat as I saw the achievement pop up on my screen with my name being announced to the entire server. Moose Cat achieved Realm First Zen Master Herbalist. Looking back, I'm still super proud of the work I put in and how it paid off. That was the most intense 15 minutes of flower picking of my entire life. It was also the hardest I've ever nerded out on stats, gear, roots, mob spawns, and timing. I was never that enthusiastic for raids, don't tell my raid leader. Um, thanks Stephanie for your contributions to the video. Um, so how about you guys? Any wow achievements or feats of strength that you're super proud of? Let's talk about it in the comments or on Discord, and don't forget, if you like what you see here in this video and want a chance at one of these original drawings from Drawsome Gaming, among other rewards, take a look at my Patreon, link in the description. Stay tuned next Saturday at 10am for the next episode of our Blizzard-themed December. Okay, love you, bye!